Okay, so first I'm going to show you the metal halide system that I'm running right now, um, which is 1,000 watts. It's an eye power. And <clears throat> it's a magnetic ballast with uh, three settings. Uh, so basically I'm running 1,000 watts and I'm uh, growing that lemon tree over there under it. For the winter and then this will go back out in the uh in the yard but uh the average consumption of this light right now is about 30 to 36 dollars a month and uh you know got to tighten up and get the bills paid so uh, i decided to go with uh an led light which is made by gringo uh it's chinese version uh it's 1200 watts equivalent to the thousand watt. So basically it says that that light is gonna put out the same amount of light as the thousand watt uh, metal halide I have right there. Uh, which by the way, uh, magnetic ballast, you could run HPS or metal halide. Uh, it runs both, you don't even need to switch it out. But downside to metal halide is you got this big hood, you got that big bulb, uh, then you gotta hook into a ballast um, where, you know, with the LED, it's pretty much you're just plugging it in and, and hanging it up and you're done. So, uh, yeah, 1,200 watts. It, it's pulling, I think, 265 or 285 watts out of the, uh, out of the wall. So right now I'm running 1,000 watts out of the wall and I'll be moving down to 285 watts. And, uh, supposedly it's going to give me the same amount of light as this. So here's the before, and I'll show you what it'll look like with the uh, with the LED lights on. And uh, yeah, so we'll be right back. So for comparison, I'll do the same walk. Of course, it's really pink looking. It's like, <laughs> but I'll tell you what, it makes the flowers look really yellow. I mean, you can really see the flowers, and they're just blooming. And then, uh, but yeah, so there's the light. hard to tell if I feel like it's uh, as bright as the uh, metal halide and I, I can tell you aesthetically pleasing to my eyes when I look at my koi um, at first I, I, w I wasn't too thrilled with this color so I went and kind of got this light here so I can you know kind of give myself a little bit of offset but the more that I was in here kind of looking around, I, I realized that it's actually, it's not too bad. Your eyes kind of actually adjust to it and it really doesn't seem that bad when I'm in here. I'm sure it'll be different when I walk out. So uh, yeah, I uh, got it about, uh, let's see, I'm, I'm six foot. So it's about six and a half feet off the ground. My uh, lemon tree is about six foot right there, but most of the flowers are about five foot. Plus I got it tied down a little bit. Um, and then, uh, so there's probably about three foot between the flowers and the, uh, and, and the space there. So yeah, I'll have to send an update and see, uh, if, if anything's going on or if I feel like, uh, it's a waste of time. So, uh, if you're interested, you can check in in about uh, a couple weeks.